fellow Dappadors, Adam Dukes here. How would you like to earn $1,600 for reading a single book? Now, I know that sounds absolutely absurd. A very clickbaity headline. Let me explain. So, about 10 days ago, I made a TikTok video covering this exact topic. Now, TikTok, you're limited to 60 seconds, so it's hard to go into details on this strategy. That TikTok is around 105,000 views right now. Uh, it kind of went viral on me. I had no idea it would be that good. There were several people that reached out, commented, that the website that I'm going to share here in a second crashed. So I don't know if it was my TikTok video that did that. It certainly could have. Uh, but there's a lot of people that asked a lot of questions. I'm going to answer probably about eight or ten of the most commonly asked questions at the end of this video. But what the basics of this is there are authors out there and with the rise of audiobooks over the last two or three years a lot of people listening to books on the go um, they are looking for people to narrate their book a lot of these authors don't have the desire nor the time to record their own books so that's where you come in you can narrate these books and you can get paid a couple hundred dollars an hour for reading specific books. Now you do have to audition for it, and I'm gonna go into all of that here in a minute. That was one of the biggest questions was auditioning for it. So let me switch over to my screen here. And so the website is called ACX. As you can see, we have about 2,500 titles, uh, 220,000 producers to choose from, and 208,000 audiobooks on sale at Audible, Amazon, and iTunes. So this is, it's kind of a pretty simple homepage. How it works, you just go up here, you go to narrator, and it gives you kind of a 10 step process on how to get started with some images here. The website's still loading up, it's taking a second. Create a profile, upload samples, how do you wanna get paid, audition, accept the offer, start recording, work with other studio professionals, finish the recording, get paid, come back for more. So what we're gonna do is go up to step number four. Now I definitely recommend going in order, but for this video, I'm just gonna show you how you can search for different books, different genres, different amounts being paid. So here are the books, as you can see, 2,400 different books that people are looking for, authors are looking for narrators. You can sort by genre, you can sort by gender, compensation, fiction, language, accent, focal style, voice age, project length, and project status. So for right here, I'm just gonna show you how to search by compensation. You click here, so you can do pay for production, you can check these boxes, or you can do a royalty share, so you earn a percentage of each and every sale of that book. These books could pay you for years and years to come. Now the royalty share is not gonna be a lot of money, it's probably gonna be a couple cents. However, if it's a great book and it continues selling for years and years, that's a great way to make some passive income for years and years to come. So what this is, 50 to $100, per finished hour. So finished hour, I, I wanna touch on this real quick, is so you do have to edit the book. Or you have to edit the audio. I'm gonna share a free software with you in a second. So per finished hour means you recording it and with the editing. So per finished hour might take you a little bit longer. It's gonna take you longer than 60 minutes. It might take you an hour and a half. It might take you two hours. It might take you three hours. Who knows, everyone's going to vary. This was a very common question that people asked. Um, your first couple books, it's probably gonna take you a little bit longer. But once you get it down, I talked to a guy that's been doing this for years, he says it takes him about two hours for one finished hour. So just wanna kind of explain the per finished hour because that was a very popular question. So let's say we're looking for 50, 100, 200. We'll click apply and we'll just open up. Let's go down some erotica books, passive income. Let's open up that passive income from Tony here. And let me see if we can do one more. This yoga one will open up and then we'll go to each and it will show us how much. So estimated length, just under 12 hours. So project budget is 50 to $100 per finished hour. So if it's a 12, if it's gonna take you right about 1200, uh, 12 hours, I'm sorry, it's going to be, you could earn 600 to $1,200 for the complete project for this specific book. Let's check out this one here. So here's another one, Wild Hearts. It's 3.4 hours, about three and a half hours. It's gonna be $50 to $100 per finished hour. So what's that? I'm doing the math in my head, 350. So $175 to $350 for this specific book here for the completed project. Again, recording it and then also editing the audio. And I do believe they have some training on editing the audio. Let's go over here. So here is the software while the other pages uh, load up. Here is the free software, Audacity. This is probably one of the 
leading audio editing software. I heard about it years and years and years ago, uh, but it's completely free. There'll be a link down below where you can download it. Uh, I don't have a ton of experience with it. I've used it several times over the years, um, maybe once or twice a year I'll use it, so I'm by no means an expert, but it's relatively simple to use. And again, they have some training on how to uh, use this software as well. Here is another one. This is passive income. So let's let's just round up to five hours. It's easier for math. So $250 to $500 for this completed book. And then one last one. I'm trying to see if we can find any in the $300 to $400 range because they certainly do have those ones. These ones, majority of them seem to be in the $100 to $200 or the $50 per hour to $200 per hour. So here's another one. Uh, just over three three hours, fifty to one hundred dollars per finished hour, three thirty thousand words. So that is pretty much how you um, apply, apply and narrate for the books. Like I said, if you go back to this page here, follow these ten steps. It's pretty easy to get a set up a profile and just kind of follow these steps. What you're going to do is upload a couple of the samples uh, for different genres, for different books that you want to, and then the author will reach out to you if they like the sound of your voice. So I want to go over a couple of the, like I said, a couple of the questions that I was asked. So one of the most popular ones, and I, I lost faith in humanity, was you have to apply for this. Um, and another variation was, uh, do I still get paid even if I don't get selected? And it's, no, you don't get paid. It's just like a job. You apply for it, and the author is going to pick the best candidate, whatever voice, whatever sound or voice that they like best. Now, you don't have to be the best voice in the world. It, that doesn't matter. You have to be the best voice to that author. Uh, and, th and that's the biggest thing. There's a lot of people, there's a couple of people, I should say, not a lot, um, stutter, accent, speech impediment, a lot of these people, or there were people that were um, saying, well, this isn't for me because I have a Southern accent. One lady said that. There could be a book out there that's maybe perfect for a Southern accent. She was basically saying, I'm not going to do this because I have a Southern accent. You can't win a race if you don't start the race. No, a lot of people just defeat themselves before even getting started. And I saw a ton on this, on this specific video. And like I said, it made me lose faith in humanity. A lot of people were just like, nope, I can't do it. I have a speech impediment. Nope, I have a stutter. Nope, I have an accent. Well, no, you're not going to win with that attitude. You're not going to get chosen with that attitude. You can't win if you don't audition. So that really kind of upset me. So you do have to audition. They will pick the best one. It's just like, like I said, going to get a job. You can, they're going to pick the best candidate. Uh, the next one is, do you need a mic? And yes, you do need a microphone. So here's the microphone I've been using right here uh, for the last several years. I picked it up at Best Buy. I think I got it. It was right around this price, 45, 50 bucks, something like that, probably three, maybe even four years ago. It's a very popular one. As you can see, 11,000 reviews, almost a perfect uh, four and a half out of five stars. There will be a link down below if you want to check out this mic. But yes, you do need a professional mic. That was a very, very common question. People want to know if I could, if they could record it from their phone, their tablet. No, you can't. Uh, get a professional mic. Use Audacity to edit the audio and then do it in a quiet space. Um, a closet is something I've always heard people record audiobooks. It's as weird as that sounds, and one lady actually left a comment that she auditioned for like three or four different books. I was so happy that she did. I, I made a TikTok video just to congratulate her for actually taking action, and then she jumped on a TikTok live stream later that night and said that's exactly what she did. She went in a closet underneath her stairs going up, up to the upstairs of her house, and she shut the door and recorded um, three or four different auditions because she has, she said furry babies, dogs or cats or something. She didn't want that noise in the background. So you do have to find a quiet space to record. Uh, another question was, do you get automatically accepted or is your voice competing against everyone else who selects the same book? Yes, exactly. Like I said, applying for the job, you're going to be competing with others. The ones that pay three to $400 an hour, those are probably very, very competitive, you would imagine. So maybe when you're getting started, shoot for the $50 to $100 ones. There's probably not as much competition in those lower ones. Get a feel for it. Get some practice and then start applying to those higher dollar ones, those three to four hundred dollar ones. And what's really cool is about the ACX website is eventually you get a profile and you get ratings, like a star rating. Eventually, if you do it enough times and you have good reviews and the authors are happy with your work, eventually you'll have authors coming to you where you don't have to search, where you don't have to apply, uh, or audition, I should say. They'll come to you and ask to work with you. That way you can start charging higher rates once you start getting some good feedback and good testimonials from other authors. 
Uh, another one is, do you have to pay for the audition? No, you do not. You just sign up for the account and audition for the books. Another one was, can I do it for my phone tablet? I already answered that. How many hours does it take to create one finished hour? Again, like I said, everyone's going to be different. It's probably going to take you longer when getting started. Once you get a feel for it, it might take you three hours. It might take you four hours to do it. However, if they're paying $200 an hour, it takes you four hours. That's about 50 bucks an hour. Not bad for just reading a book and then being able to edit in that. But again, over time, you're gonna get better and condense that time and maybe you can do one finished hour in two hours. It's like that guy, like I said, he's been doing it for years and he says it takes him about two hours to read the book and also edit the audio. Our next one is, um, the, the I already talked about the Southern accent. Do you edit yourself or just record and do the editing? Like I said, Audacity is a great tool to use to edit the audio. Do you have to buy the book to audition for it? I think one or two people ask this. You do not have to buy the book. As far as I know, I have never done this. I've heard of other people do that. I should make that clear. A lot of people ask that. I've never done it myself. I have seen other people do it. I've heard about it and people have had success with it. So I've never done it. I don't believe you have to pay for the book. But even if you did, it shouldn't be more than 10 bucks. But I highly doubt they'd make you pay for the book. And then the last one is, oh, the last one is, I would love this, but I have a stutter. Again, Stutter, speech impediment, I get it, but you're defeating yourself before entering the race. You know, maybe maybe the author likes that style. Who the hell knows? There's only one way to find out. Audition for the book. Speech impediment, stutter, accent, really doesn't matter. Maybe an author is looking for that. You never know unless you try. So that is how you can earn up to $1,600 for reading a book. Actually, you can earn quite a bit more than that, but if I used a bigger <laughs> number than 1600 I know a lot of people would say it was complete bullshit. Hey, if you're looking to earn money uh, with high-ticket affiliate marketing, that is what uh, a lot of what I do, how do I make money online. I also sell my own courses and that, but if you're looking for high-ticket affiliate marketing, it's a great be beginner-friendly business. Click the link down below, adamdukes.com forward slash go. It's a six-minute video uh, showing you the four-step process that I use to make money on the internet. I also just rewrote my email sequence. I spent seven hours yesterday. So all those YouTubers that say they sit on the beach and just count money, it's bullshit. There is work involved. I spent seven hours on a Sunday rewriting my entire email sequence. I literally take, I have taken my 10 years of knowledge in this space and compacted it into about, I think it's eight emails right now, nine emails right now. And you get all of that like I said, completely free, adamdukes.com forward slash go. Skip the decade of mistakes I've made and learn from me uh, the golden nuggets that I take of the last 10 years. adamdukes.com forward slash go. If you have any comments, questions, concerns about this ACX narrating the book, drop them down below. I'll do my absolute best to answer them. If I can't answer the question, I'll try to find someone who can or point you in the right direction, point you in the right resource to get that question answered. If it's about ACX, they are probably have a pretty good customer support that they can answer questions as well. A lot of people were coming to me like I was the expert asking just very detailed questions. And I was kind of like, well, the website would probably know more about that. So uh, I'll try to answer. If I can't answer, I'll likely point you into uh, towards ACX. If you like these videos, I put out two videos each and every week for your viewing pleasure. Hit subscribe. Click that little bell notification because it'll alert you every time I put out a video. As always, thank you so much for watching. I truly do appreciate it.